got married and that preacher asked for better or for worse, I didn't have any idea it was going to be anything like this. Ever since that boy of yours moved in here, it's been one thing after another. Oh, yeah, well, when you proposed, you said you loved me, warts and all. I guess he's just one of my warts. <laughs> what are you implying, anyway, that my boy is goofus and yours is gallant? Can we do that? Can we change the names to goofus and gallant? Or Cain and Abel? Anything's better than two fussing out of two boys named Tim. Well, one's Tim and one's Timothy. And they're our boys, not yours and not mine. They're ours, and I got that right, mister. I tell you what, after what they did, that butt's going to be ours for a long time. There's an old African proverb. It takes a village to raise a child. Apparently, it also takes a village to punish a child. Because around here, everybody knows everybody else's business. You boys should be ashamed. Guess you ride home after school. There's lots of sticks left in the Oh. Hey, which one of you is cheap? Which one of you is charm? <laughs> <laughs> My mom says you boys are bad news, so stay away from me. That goes double for me. What? Wait a minute. You're the one that sold me that stuff. <laughs> Duh, duh.